Welcome to the most hectic week of my life. If I think about this week only, I get stressed. I have so many shoots back to back. Navratri is full blown on. What the fuck? My flight is at 6:45, and it is 6 o'clock right now, and I'm still in the gap. Good morning. It is 4:30 a.m. Hi guys, I'm Gangsha. Welcome back to my channel. Yeah. My eyes are not even opening because I slept like for two, three hours. But uh, welcome to the most hectic week of my life. If I think about this week only, I get stressed. I have so many shoots back to back. Navratri is full blown on. I should have started the vlog yesterday. But uh, my stupid brain forgot about it. About it like always. But yesterday I shot two videos for Navratri. Yesterday whole day I was shooting, and today I'm going to a set to shoot, and then I have like I'm going to Bombay tomorrow. A lot of things are happening, so let's get ready. I, koi, koi, kushi, kushi. Hi Kushi. She also woke up with me in the morning, 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 morning. Babbo ko na na into tinder invitation. Hmm. Which kapu? My face is so swollen. Uh, today also I was supposed to shoot two videos. I was supposed to shoot uh, with Navya, and then I was supposed to shoot my one solo. But that one solo outfit didn't come. Only oh my god, the stress to get the right outfits, jewelry, and everything has been real this time. Oof. So in the end minute, my lehenga did not come. So now I'm going all the way to Kisara, which is like an hour away, just to shoot one outfit, and then I'll come back. Hopefully, my lehenga, if it comes by afternoon, at least I can shoot in the evening. But again, I don't have a location for that. Uh, wake up This is my outfit Now we are come Are I thought I'm doing I am not stressed when I am jal and vlog jay and put some I myself come from village, sir. <laughs> What the fuck? Anna white pants. Karan is there. Oh. Whole cool white pants. How do you feel? Head is spinning. Oh, chill, chill. Oh, oh. Done. Now we are going to now make her bed. Done with the shoot. Going versus coming back. I look so different, but I'm on my way. It took so much longer. I thought we'd be done in like one two hours, but it took us four hours to get everything right. But I think we got really nice shots. Our outfit uh, inspiration was this picture. I'll do it. I'll tell you. Now you'll understand why we made that. So Navya, I'm collaborating with Navya, like you saw. So Navya series is doing nine outfits from scratches because she has her own label where you can get these outfits done as well if you guys want to. So there, there, I really like this dress. I've been meaning to get this one for a while. And when Navya asked, we'll do like concept is like. This is it. We are doing it, but that again, the main problem with that was it has corset, and Navya used to not do corsets, but now she has actually learned for this, and then it actually worked out, and the corset sat very well. It's a little different uh, for that one to this one, but she did it, and it actually looks really nice. The fitting, everything was really nice. 
but oh my god so tired it was so sunny already it was so hot and the lights we have those i don't know what those lights are called it was hot but i'm going back home i'll take a nap and then i have to shoot another video hopefully today and uh, tomorrow what is going on my brain at this point is not functioning so let's go okay guess who didn't shoot after coming back home because she was beyond exhausted reached home at 2 o'clock i had lunch and i passed out to mara for sure okay guys i'm finally in mumbai i just checked into my hotel and uh, there are few things i find like very very boring to do and uh, uh taking flights or like the flight ride has to be like one of the top most i find it so damn boring i just hate sitting in that flight for 1 hour 1 and 1/2 hour um especially domestic ones because you have nothing else to do as well and uh, my skin also has been reacting because of all the stuff i've been doing like a lot of makeup my hair to you leave I've, it's been behaving and been good with me for a while but i'm getting a break out here getting a break out my forehead because so much makeup so much outdoor yesterday literally we were shooting in like that sun and it was hot hot af yeah i am here with amazon i have an amazon live i have two lives today i have to go like there in one hour but i thought i'll just eat a uh, check in and go let me show you my room this is my o o t d by the way why is it so dark like it's like a quad set where it's like comfy comfy and this is the room just ordered food it came about to eat and then go this is the room from my hotel and for the first time the view is not bad always in mumbai hotels the view is so shitty even if you pay like really good good like amount for rooms it has like shit all over or some kachra all over but this is at least nice people might get mad if i say this but after living in a city like hyderabad living in bombay is such a i don't i don't think so like i can ever see myself living here man like i have considered it for my profession a lot of times but it's just not the vibe like compared to the lifestyle i have in hyderabad i don't think i can live in very small houses you can only have like a big house in mumbai if you're earning like crazy shit ton of money and the traffic oh my god i know it'll be like really helpful for my career but bro it's just not happening it's so trashy trashy everywhere and it's such a hustle culture I think I lose myself only if I come to Bombay. But every time I'm here, one thing I always take is blue toka. Any time I go anywhere like Delhi, Bombay, whichever city has blue toka and its food, I always order that. So good coffee, good sourdough bread. I'm set, bro. I'm set. done <laughs> two lives finally finally with this look finally retreat to but it went actually quite quick i thought there much more time yeah but you know ha i got back to the hotel i just ordered food my thali is here when in doubt always go for a thali also thali after a long day such a ha bliss but i'm so beyond exhausted i i didn't even feel like removing my makeup i just ordered food i do, i'm not carrying a night dress i don't have nothing to change into but i just eat and like remove my makeup but uh, long day guys the next day I had my boy woke up, had my breakfast, got fresh, 
I'm on my way to Shalini's house. If you guys don't know Shalini, her username is your Shane. This Shalini Kuti. I'm going to um, go meet her. It's been a while that I meet her. Every time I'm com coming to Bombay lately, I just am like in and out in a day. I come in the morning, I leave in the night. So today I have time and uh, we are planning to shoot a video for Navratri. So I'm going to go to, uh, shoot with her and then I have a flight uh, in the evening. So I have to go back to Hyderabad. I'm a vlog after like two three years. But yeah. Hi guys. Hi guys. Welcome to my room. <laughs> <laughs> this is the finished finished look which I forced her to yeah, get I've into. Yeah, forced to do this entire thing. <laughs> But yeah, you got it. The only thing I couldn't things. force her is the nose, nose pin. pin. Yeah. <laughs> That's everything she did it for me. But yeah, yeah cute, it no? It was fun. We're yeah. done. We I took more time to do my make our makeup than like actually yeah, shoot the video. Shooting. Yeah. <laughs> I got done with the shoot uh, with Faye and I started off to the airport and I think I should have started like half an hour ago because there's like too much traffic and I'm not sure if I'll reach the airport on time and um, today has to the first Navratri video has to go live and I still don't did not edit it yet I'm trying to edit it but it's just I don't know if it'll even go up today if it doesn't go up today then I don't know I've done like so much effort with this but what to do my mind is not working to say I'm like I I try to do like at least the first draft, but uh, I'm trying to sit and do it. And my head like aches a lot if I'm editing while I'm moving, so I'm trying not to. But if I don't edit now, I don't know if I'll go be have time to go there, sit and edit. I want this to go live. It's been more than an hour that I started. My flight is at six forty-five, and it is six o'clock right now, and I'm still in the cab. I really hope I make it because the boarding generally the check-in closes like 45 minutes before. If not that, then I'll have to just take the next flight. But I really, really hope I don't miss the flight. For like 30 minutes travel, I started one hour earlier, and still it took me like one hour 10 minutes to just to travel. This Bombay traffic is so unpredictable. I don't know, man. I do not need this today. I have, I have a shoot plan tomorrow. Mera, it's now mind fuck ho gaya, bro. Like, I'm so done with today. Uh, I started on time. It's not like I started late. I started at uh, 4.45. I mean, I don't know. It's so unpredictable. I should have started like 20, 30 minutes early probably. But I was just working. My two th cabs get, uh, got cancelled. The one which came also came 5 minutes late. So there only like 20 minutes. Ka ye ho gaya tha, bana. 4.30 I had booked my flight. Sorry, my cab and it showed like 30 minutes ETA. So it's like 5.20, 5.50 max. 5.30 I'll reach 6.45 flight which did not happen. I missed my flight. I requested so many people. It did not happen. So I was like, okay, fuck it. I'll book another flight. So there was an Indigo flight like three hours later. So I booked that flight. And uh, I booked that. I went to the counter. Um, that's like I gave her the bag. She took the bag. Like, okay, I booked. I, I could be stupid. I didn't see it. In Hyderabad, we don't have like uh, different terminals. We just have like one airport. So like I booked it. But the person who took my bag also, she knows that I am in T2. She took my bag. It went. And then while I was going to security check, <laughs> I don't know. There my scan boarding pass was not getting scanned because of course I'm in the wrong terminal altogether. So there they sent back and the by that time I went to the counter, my bag went off and then she's like, Nay madam, you'll get your bag, you'll get your bag, you have three hours, Ajayga T1 pay. Now I've trusted her. Then I was like, okay, fine, I'll leave the airport, I'll at least take my cap to the T1 because if the because of the traffic, if I miss that flight also it'll be like stupid. So then I was exiting the airport, they won't let me exit. They, uh, there has to be some employee there and the Air India people won't give give any assistance and I went again to the counter get got that person and they are asking 100 questions that how did you get another boarding pass again why did they take your bag all that nonsense and finally I got in the car now I don't have my check-in bag 
just have my bag. I actually thought, okay, flight, my flight is missing. I can at least edit my video. I was like, maybe it's like a sign from God that don't miss your Navratri series. Post the first video because if I was in a flight, I was not, able, I would obviously like not be able to write. So I was like, okay, I'll go sit and like edit that video and post. Uh, but. It's just God's plan to irritate me today. I feel because na na he like my video is happening. Neither am I taking my flight. I'm again going to a different terminal. I at least don't have a check-in, so I can just directly walk in and um, just like go to security. But so irritating. I don't know when things happen. If they happen all at once, I have like I I thought I'll shoot like early morning, five o'clock. Let's see. I will go like nine o'clock. Go like try different things or whatever. It's a little irritating, but I just want to go home at this point. No matter how last minute it was, I always made it to my flight. My streak of not missing a flight broke today. God, I got my bag, guys. Long, long trip. Even this flight that I took got cancelled. Not cancelled, sorry, delayed again for like one hour. Today is something wrong only. Mercury is in retrograde. I was supposed to reach home by eight, and now it's twelve, and I just landed. Morning four o'clock. I thought I was sure. I'm tired. Okay, landed day before night. Uh, yesterday I couldn't shoot, but today I'm here. At with the cutest teddy. <laughs> That's about it for this vlog, you guys. I ah, I just came home. I got done with the shoot the shoot came out so well the teddy was so cute uh, anything this anybody does in that costume i feel like i'm I, i was finding it so funny i was constantly laughing but the shoot went well i'm excited um, to edit it and see but i'm going to end this vlog right here i have another shoot tomorrow but i feel like the vlog is getting too long and uh, yeah that's about it do i have anything else to say i have a lot of festive content going up on you uh, instagram you guys if you don't follow me there it's akanksha kumar ali go follow i have a lot, lot of fun videos there as well but um, yeah that's about it for this video i will see you guys in my next video